Church recording is an interesting and fulfilling activity of NADFAS members. Forty years ago, a template was developed with the VNA, and that template is what we'd use now. Since then, 1,700 churches have been recorded, and over 280 NADFAS church recording groups are working. So what is a record? A church record is a full list of all the furnishings in a church. We have this template which we follow, so we know what we're going to do, but it is so exciting to go into a church and not know what treasures we're going to find. The furnishings of the church are divided into sections, and each section is listed. Memorials, for example, we will record all the memorials on the walls and on the floor. It can be very difficult to decipher the inscriptions on the floor, and sometimes the church will end up smelling very strongly of imperial leather talc. All the names that we record are listed at the beginning of the record. This is important for family history researchers. It can become very interesting finding out the different members of the family and very complicated. Metalwork includes the silver. We rely very heavily on experts to help us with identifying the makers. It's very sad that so much of the church silver is stored away in a safe and never seen. Last year, we identified a 400-year-old flagon which the church hadn't realised they had got. We also record textiles, which include altar frontals and also banners, such as this lovely banner here. We try to identify the stitching and look at the condition, and if there are problems, we can always refer the church to our heritage volunteers to help to restore it. Woodwork also includes cupboards and chests, and imagine the excitement last year when they opened a chest, they found a King James VI Bible which they did not realise they owned. Windows are another exciting section to record. With digital photography, it is very useful to have a photograph of the window to help us identify the subject matter of the window. We have also identified makers which have not been known before. It's very important that we are accurate in what we record because our records go to the National Archive as well as the local church and the local archives. They also go to the V&A and to Church House for the Church of England churches. They will be used as sources for research and for family history. No one is an expert when they start, but if you want to learn, start new skills, find out about your local history and help in the history of the country, then you will enjoy church recording. Church recording is a very social activity. We go to the church together, we work in small groups, and it's helpful at the end of the morning to share the interesting things that we have found. There is so much satisfaction in finding what is in a church. Someone once said that going into a church is like having a treasure hunt. It has also been said that recording needs patience, the willingness to check facts, the ability to write unambiguous English and a supply of warm underwear. Mm -hmm.